Traditionally, chicha was made by chewing germinated corn and spitting the liquid into a clay pot or chombra, where it would ferment, creating alcohol and CO2. If the pots were sealed and unable to vent the CO2, they would often explode. While the chewing process is no longer practiced, chicha's popularity with cusqueños has not. Finding a traditional chicharia is a simple task. Just look for one of these red bags tied to a stick suspended above a doorway. It's a sign that someone inside is serving chicha. Salud, my brother. Salud. Causaipa. For the life. Causaipa. The strawberry version of this drink is made by taking the normal yellow chicha, adding some spices to it, like cloves, straining, and then adding in blended strawberries. Hey, be careful to chicha. Okay, por qué? Por qué? Cuando es your first time, yeah? the chicha inside to digestion, yeah? it's possible you go to the bathroom. That's right, because this drink is currently fermenting, drinking too much chicha too fast can lead to some intestinal issues. Kinda wish I would've known that earlier.